My name is David Colthard. I'm an ageing ex Grand Prix driver and current commentator for Channel 4 Formula 1. I was very lucky in that my hobby became my profession. I started karting at the uh, very old age of 11. Managed to race for the first time in Formula 1 in 1994. That led to a 15-year career in Formula 1 before progressing into being a full-time commentator. When I first started watching Formula One, Murray Walker and James Hunt were commentating from a studio in London, so they were completely detached from the emotion of what was happening. And they were relying on phone conversations or you know, telefaxes, as it was at that time, where, of course, today we have a lot more information at our disposal, we do a lot more research, we have live updates in the commentary box, and that's how we are able to give a much more full picture of what's actually happening out in the racetrack. When I started in 94, we had two or three buttons in the car that we could adjust. Today, the cars are finely tuned works of engineering art, of which the driver is constantly tweaking them to make sure he's getting the best out of it. This is where Formula One has become so much more efficient. The engineers back in the factories don't have to take a long flight and have the jet lag associated with that. They can stay fresh and sharp and be living the experience of what's happening at the racetrack as if they're there because of this modern day connectivity. With virtual reality, with the simulation technology, with the amount of data and connectivity that the teams have today, they're able to preempt failures in the car and find solutions for them by finding the weakest link before you even put it on the racetrack. The thing that I really appreciate about the F1 Connectivity Innovation Prize is the opportunity that's been given to the fans of the sport. It's a beautiful showcase for their thought process, their fault finding, and without them, we don't have a professional sport. You know, they are the lifeblood of what gives us this opportunity.